It has been nearly a decade since the Jenkins Cavaliers have had a winning season, but despite not picking up many wins over the years, the Cavaliers' hopes are high as they try to turn things around this season. EKB Scott Robinson takes us to Jenkins in this installment of In the Huddle. In the Huddle is brought to you by A-Plus Rentals. The Jenkins Cavaliers finished 1-10 last season, but the players and coaching staff aren't letting a string of losing seasons to find the attitude going into 2016. Head coach and former player Matt Fleming's goal is to restore the community pride that was formerly reserved for the Cavaliers on the gridiron. That's one thing, you know, we got to get back. You know, Jenkins, you know, back in the day, you know, they were good. They had tradition. They had some good football teams. And over the last couple of years, it's just been rough here, and people's forgot, you know, how good Jenkins used to be. So that's what I want to teach the young guys that it has happened here before. That way we can, you know, start that tradition going forward. Fleming has let his team know it won't be an easy road ahead, but nevertheless a rewarding one if they put in the work and effort needed to get over the hump and contend with fellow opponents. You, nothing's easy, and I could tell my guys, you know, if it was easy, there, then winning wouldn't be special. So, you know, when we win, it means you outwork the other team. You know, Pikeful, you know, it's always going to be a tough job, but I want to change the mindset. I don't want to be, you know, afraid of Pikeful and Hazard. I want to come out and, you know, do what we can to try to beat them. According to two senior Cavaliers, Matthew Jesse and Darian Sloan, the keys to success are staying focused and listening to their coaches, who they've grown close to over their years at Jenkins. You just got to keep your head high. When something's bad, you got to, you know, pat everybody on the back. You help people out. Coach Fleming's the best coach I've ever had. I've never had the relationship, the one-on-one -on -one relationship with a coach like I have with Fleming, Coach Fleming. And I think we really like that here. Reporting for EKB News, I'm Scott Robinson. The Cavaliers season opener is set for next Friday, August 19th at McCreary Central followed by two more road games before their first home game of the season against Lynn Camp on September 16th. Jenkins' schedule only features three home games this season as they look to make a comeback. 